There was another scare today inside a triad school. Today, deputies say they found a part of a weapon at West Forsyth High School. This discovery led to rumors online and some tense moments for parents and students waiting for answers. WFM News 2's Hannah Jeffries is outside the school tonight with details on what happened. Hundreds of high schoolers were put on secure status today, and this comes as administration and deputies were searching for an inoperable object, a part of a weapon. They say this status means to get inside and lock the doors. The school system sent out a message to parents saying it got a tip this morning of a potential weapon on school grounds. As they looked into this claim, administration placed the school in a secure and hold protocol for safety reasons. With the help of Forsyth County Sheriff's deputies, the school confiscated an inoperable part of a weapon. Lori Watt's son goes to the high school. Watt recalls how she felt when her son texted her about what was going on. Automatically just freaked out and started crying because the thought of losing my child, I just couldn't, I couldn't handle it. The sheriff's office expelled rumors of an active shooter situation on campus within a social media post. The office tweeted in part, contrary to social media rumors, there was not an active shooter or a shooting at West Forsyth High School today. The sheriff's office also said in a statement, the sheriff's office would like to remind people that when they see something on social media, they should send it immediately to investigators and reach out to verify the authenticity and not share it. The sheriff's office also said that this can lead to challenges when trying to figure out where the post originated. They also say that um, it can also spread fear for no reason. Live in Clemens, I'm Hannah Jeffries, WFMY News 2.